Venezuela does not want to become a U.S. colony. That's the message from these supporters of Nicolas Maduro. Despite calls from inside and outside his country to step down, the Venezuelan president appeared defiant. And he blamed Venezuela's recent political turmoil on one man. Since Chavez's death, we have faced many attacks. But it has become worse under Trump's presidency. Since the man with extreme ideas has come to power, the United States has been attacking us. And now they're plotting a coup. <laughs> Relations between Venezuela and the U.S. have plummeted since Wednesday after Venezuela's opposition leader Juan Guaido declared himself interim president. The U.S. has backed Guaido and has urged countries to cut off financial support for Maduro's government. In response, Maduro broke ties with the Trump administration but has suspended his demand that U.S. diplomats leave Venezuela. Leaders of several European countries, including Britain, France and Germany, have demanded Maduro holds elections within the next eight days, saying his re-election last May was rigged. But other countries, including Russia, South Africa, India and Turkey, have backed Maduro. We need to ensure peace in Venezuela. We have to support Venezuela in overcoming its economic problems. Everyone should also be respectful of the president, who was elected by popular vote. The U.S. Security Council hasn't taken action on the Venezuelan crisis because of the divisions. Maduro says Guaido's declaration violates the country's constitution. But Guaido has promised to end Venezuela's economic, social and political crisis. Now it's time for us to be together. And we have to use the constitution of the country. It's not the time to be fragmented. It's not a time to disrespect the people of Venezuela. Under Maduro, inflation has risen to more than a million percent in the past year. And food shortages have led to protests and mass immigration. But with the current political impasse showing little signs of ending, things could get worse. Shamim Chowdhury, TRT World.